Elena Angel Ingram was born on December 1st, 2001, and she and her biological brother were adopted by Johnny and Daphne Ingram at six months old in Lincolnton, North Carolina. So, we was adopted together, and then there was others of us that was adopted together as well. Uh, there was Ravante and Raquel, uh, Keechwan and Chastity, and then Solana was the only child, and then Jonathan was the child that they, uh, that my adopted parents actually had themselves um, but I love I love my family that I'm in now that they're all I know because uh, I was a baby so they're all I know and I couldn't be more blessed to have them in my life. Elena attended to Lincoln Charter School and her parents were on her about going to college. She had many to choose from and she ended up going to Gaston College because it was more affordable and she plans to go to law school after earning her associate's degree. I was going into business administration, um, but then I got inspired to go into law because like I just like, I know I sit around watching like a lot of um, law series, like show series, like NCIS and Law and & Order and stuff like that, like I, I was just like so intrigued by like out of anything I was watching that. And um, it was between me going to school to be a lawyer or becoming a police officer, a female police officer. So I chose to be, I chose to go into school to be a lawyer and so, um, but the type of lawyer I want to be would be family law. While enrolled in Gaston College, Elena was interested in doing some work to get out of the house, and then she applied to work study and she had the privilege to work with Gene Banks before his departure. I know that my experience with him was very amazing. I was able to go to meetings, go to lunch meetings with him. Um, I drafted up letters for him, sent out emails, um, I answered the phone, I I ran errands for him and did all of that and it was um, it was pretty cool to be able to just be out there and expose like that because people see me with him and then they was like they was wanting to get to know me but you never know who could set you up for like greater opportunities down the road in your life. Life took a huge turn when Elena was pregnant to her one-year-old son, Keelan, and from that experience, she established motivation to not give up on school nor her dreams. I thought, like, I thought it was over for me. <laughs> I thought it was over, like, O-V-E-R. But, you know, the more through the pregnancy and then having Keelan, it actually grew all of my relationship with my family members stronger. They helped me raise Keelan and everything, and I, um, I appreciate them for that. The person that really motivated me to come back to school was my mom because she, um, you know, she broke it down to me because um, I, I did only have a year left. Um, and so if I would have stopped, I probably would would have extended that time. I know for sure I would have extended that time. So like, I just, it was just my son. He motivated me to come back to school as well. And my mom did because I have to get my education. Like that's all I want is my degree.